It's GED question of the day time, and we've got a simple little word problem here. It says how many square inches are in a square foot? So I have to tell you the truth, most students make a really bad assumption here. They assume that um, because there's uh, one foot is the same as 12 inches, now this is linear feet, a line um, is 12 inches in a line. Like think about a ruler, a foot long ruler has 12 inches on it. Now they assume because they know that to be true that it must also be true that one square foot is equal to 12 square inches. And that actually is a lie. That is not true. Just because linear feet um, convert to 12 linear inches doesn't mean that square feet are going to convert to square inches. In fact, something interesting is going to happen. Um, let's draw out a square in order to think about this. And so what I want to do is talk about a, a square foot. This is one square foot. What does it mean for it to be a square foot? Well, it's a square. That's one foot. And remember what it means to be a square. It means that your length and width are the same. All four sides are the same here. So it's one foot by one foot. Now, if I wanted to figure out the number of square inches in a square foot, I would have to cover this entire square with itty bitty little inch uh, squares. And so, yes, I would get 12 inch squares going across this way because one foot is equal to 12 inches. But this is not a one dimensional shape. This is a two dimensional shape. So I would also get 12 square inches going that way. This one foot is also equal to 12 inches. And if I were to just draw these across, connect these, and cover this whole entire shape by with squares, what I would end up seeing and you guys have to forgive me for being messy, but what I would end up seeing is 12 rows of 12 squares each. I would have a 12 by 12, or 144 total little squares. And so what I just learned here is that one square foot is equal to not 12 square inches, but 144 squared inches. And what I want you to notice is, if you were being lazy like a mathematician, when you square the unit, feet to square feet, you also square the numbers. Now, it doesn't make a difference when you have the number 1, because 1 squared is 1. 1 times 1 is 1. However, it sure does make a difference when you have any other number. Because if you were to square inches, inches to inches squared, you square the number 12, 12 times 12 is 144. Remember, that's what it means to square a number. It means to multiply it by itself. And now you see why we call that little floating two a square. Uh, because it's like a covering uh, a shape in squares. And so what I found out here when it asked me how many square inches are in a square foot, well, there's 144 square inches in a square foot. And careful, this little abbreviation here, it, some people, some students will read it inch two. It just means square inches. I'm just being too lazy to spell out square inches. Um, this two is not working on this 144. This two is standing for square inches. So 144 square inches is the answer here. Okay, if you have any questions about this, uh, be sure to drop them in the comments.